and it is highly likely that we will see a growing number of UK cases. I, I, I'm shaking hands continuously. I was, at a, I was at a hospital the other night where I think there were, a few, there were actually a few coronavirus uh, patients and I shook hands with everybody. I've got to be clear, we've all got to be clear, this is the worst public health crisis for a generation. I can announce today an unprecedented package of government-backed and guaranteed loans to support business to get through this. And that is how, by a mixture of collective, determined collective action, and scientific progress, I have absolutely no doubt that we will turn the tide of this disease. The Prime Minister chaired the 915 meeting and was full of vigour and giving us the leadership we need and we're a united uh, cabinet team in, ter in terms of getting the country through this crisis. Today marks a sombre day in the impact of this disease as we join the list of countries who have seen more than 10,000 deaths. To protect your friends and your family, testing and tracing must become a new way of life. We set out the first three steps we will take carefully to modify the measures, gradually ease the lockdown and begin to allow people to return to their way of life. This will, will, will require international arrivals to self-isolate for 14 days. That is the incubation period of the virus. I think he followed the instincts of every father and every parent. And I do not mark him down for that. I said we would turn the tide, and I really think we did uh, within 12 weeks. If you look at where the disease is now, to, you know, we, we went through the peak. I would um, be surprised and delighted if we weren't in this current situation through the winter and into next spring. I think then let's regroup and work out where we are. The economic health of the whole country is dependent on every single one of us acting responsibly. But we must keep our discipline and our focus, and we cannot be complacent. You must not meet socially in groups of more than six, and if you do, you will be breaking the law. I, I can't promise that everyone can go back to the job that they used to have, and that's why you know, in the summer, we outlined a range of measures to help people find new opportunities.